I had a very nice time in the late eighties. It was um, the football league centenary dinner at the Grosvenor House Hotel in London, uh, in the main ballroom. I think they called a grand ballroom. And uh, it sounds good. I had I had dinner with Pele. I didn't speak to him there. And Tom Finney, the first English manager, he was there in the bar. I didn't speak to him either. The next day with him was Jimmy Hill. I didn't speak to him. And um, it was good to see Pelly because he's a, a favourite of mine since I was living in Tottenham when I was in junior school. Uh, Brazilian best football player in the world. But I was sitting at a table and on my table it was quite an interesting time because my dad had some difficulty when I was 14 at school and uh, a local psychiatrist and uh, the family doctor, Dr John Nicholas, uh, Nicholas um, uh, sorted things out for a few weeks. I think mistakenly it shouldn't have happened, but anyway. Uh, John Nicholas was uh, the chief uh, doctor at Empire House Surgery in Swindon. And he had uh, many doctors under his control. So it was very hard to see him because he was always too busy. He was also a consultant at a local um, Prince Margaret's Hospital. But anyway, he was a club doctor, and when he first saw me, he was very hesitant to come in the office, very subservient. You know, it's the title of company secretary, with uh, a red and green light outside the door, was a bit um, too much for him. Anyway, I said, come in, John, don't worry, just come in. Uh, anyway, I went uh, on the train with uh, jo Dr. John Nicholas, um, the club secretary, Doug Busbo, the commercial manager myself, and we had a great time, great dinner, a lovely venue and so many famous people, including Elton John on the stairs, talking to a friend, nobody else around, just him on the stairs. And um, one of my colleagues wanted me, if I could, he, he didn't want to ask. I've never asked anybody for an autograph in my life, apart from Ozzy Ardilis in my office. And I'd taken a picture of my son with him. And uh, I, I thought I'd ask him to, uh, later on when I got it developed, to have it um, signed for my son. My son's got it now. Uh, so I asked Elton John for his autograph, and I think he signed um, the invitation. I gave this to my daughter. Anyway, it was a fantastic, fast, fantastic evening. Goodbye.